Okay, so today is just gonna be the little podcast thing. This is basically talking about Ezra's music, is all this shit and everything. Um, basically, because I wanted to record like a feedback, a uh, feedback. Uh, by the way, just excuse the music in the background. It's a uh, Fortnite in the background. I don't know, fucking someone who's playing Fortnite. I guess. <laughs> Anyways, no. Okay, all right. So basically, to talk about basically Ezra music and Ezra media, or Ezra media as you call me, but I call myself Ezra music because it's just like whatever basically the music has been going a long time and it has been going to the point of actually like we have been beyond fucking writing music i have like 20 like 20 i have like 20 or 30 like songs produced for like six albums six fucking albums out there and i can seriously tell you right now six albums right now is going to be the top gear and everything it's just it's 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 crazy to see what the malady of minds it can actually be in the only talk and i'm just saying like i don't know how long like i'm gonna be doing this for i don't know how like i lo- i want to do music for like probably i want to say music i want to do for like maybe like an hour or two and i'm just gonna be basically writing everything and all that shit and everything i just wanted to do a little podcast today on about the music or like talking about the feedback between the music because i've heard, i've like okay so the pack with back to back i have produced so much music in the background and i have so much like the music has like went every where and it's 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 to the point of make sure i want to make sure like i tell you by like actual podcast and it's like i never really you never really hear a dj talk about his music you never really hear a dj talk about his music and i'm like okay so we've been getting like honestly on my tiktoks i'm like i I'm, people view my tiktoks and everything but i don't ever post music on there but basically people have been asking me on my like uh patreon page and my uh band camp and all that shit they're like why don't you ever write about your music or do a podcast and i'm like really honestly i'm like i was like the last guy who interviewed me when i was like having just like a it wasn't like a legit interview it was just like a little interview i guess you could say when i was starting out when i was in music and i put my first uh, show and everything it he asked me he's like what do you have the plans for the future there's a future on ahead do you want to be able to have future and, and i was like i was like okay and I straight up told him, I was like, maybe we can actually go somewhere in this music. I was like, Ezra Media needs to grow. Like, we've literally... Okay, so the basically, like, I'm going to narrow it down to, like, years before I started. When I was about 14 years old, 14 years old, literally, we started music and everything. And we started, like, it was pretty great. And, uh everything and just like stuff like that we started so much music in the background it, it took forever and i mean like that like literally swear to god it ezra media has been around for so long like i opened the youtube page on 2020 but i was doing music since i was probably about 12 years old so it's been the last 2012 2012 is when i started um I go by, I actually learned off this artist called uh, Obsidian, uh, Obsidian Media. From, he's from the U, he's from UK, but he's literally one of the best media DJs on YouTube. And he literally has like 89,000 people who have subscribed to him. And he, he's, he's fucking amazing. He's fucking amazing. Okay, like, so I'm just saying, I literally have been producing like him and i've really copied his i have all his sample tracks i bought all this shit i bought everything to be able to put on to the media and i have all his patreon music and it's like hard wave is the same shit that i do i do hard wave wave or trap hip-hop the edm i i mean actually i i could do edm but i mean i really don't talk we don't talk about that i do even dubstep and techno and I like hard hard rock and shit and everything but i mean like i write music Music for like a decades and everything and i wanted to say basically to tell you like as the media has just been going so long it's so good and it's just been the full death of the feeling has been just dwelling on people and we don't even know if this would be able to be doing it so i'm just saying like as the media was like top notch one of the best people ever and everything so it's just stuff like that and it's just like 
I'm just saying, like it it, it causes it causes some commotion, and it causes like very much disrespected. And we would see like we would see that people would be asking me, be like, they they don't really okay. So we don't really ask me. They just say like, oh, what do, what are your plans for the future of your music, of Ezra? What's the music? And like we don't even know how to spray it up and give literally a sample. Like okay, we do, we do now, but we didn't when we were started. And like I was a kid and I didn't know anything about music. I didn't know nothing about music. I didn't know nothing. I was literally just like playing and I'm playing and I'm just doing good and everything. And it was just it was it was a nice moment to travel. Like like in the world of music. Like I didn't literally play any shows. I didn't play any shows. I didn't start out anywhere. I was playing in my mu like my room. I literally started out by jumping around and listening to music. That's all I started. Okay, that's how literally I started. I'm not even kidding you. I'm not even capping you. That's literally how I started. I'm gonna tell you that right now. That literally it has been it has been it's so holy holy. Like I can remember telling my grandfather that literally I wanted to produce music and he's like do it. And he's like make it happen. And I was even in guitar at the time and I was still playing guitar. But then I stopped playing guitar at like like around like tw like fifth thirteen and then I was like I gave up. And I should have stuck to those lessons because like literally it would have been great and it would have been super sick and it would have been super awesome and it's just like it would have been just great and everything and it's just stuff like that so it just it, it's it's really mo it gets me a little bit emotional to the point where because he was the one who basically like told me to do that and he was basically the one that, and i was like all right so we can actually do this and everything and it was great it was fucking to the person it was so honestly great and i'm gonna tell you this right now like music in, in the time it was just like and everybody, everybody's like, hey, you can't do that. You can't do that. Who are you going to be DJ? You can't do that. And I'm like, really? Honestly, I can even tell you the truth that I literally couldn't do it. And I still put myself into that position. I literally started, the way I started is I watched YouTube. Okay? I pretty much just YouTube everything. And I didn't even, like, actually physically get trained by Obsidian Media or Obsidian Records or whatever you call, you call them. Obsidian Media, basically, well, I, call them, I call them Obsidian Records for fun. But just in here. Anyways, Obsidian basically... I never reached out to him. I never talked to him. I don't even know him. I didn't even know his name was Dominic until fucking I looked into Apple Pay and they're like, oh yeah, Dominic something is this is you. And I'm like, what? Really? I'm like, dude, dude, and he's from the UK. And I'm like, okay, so I didn't even know his name was Dominic. And that's pretty sick, so that's pretty awesome now, too. But I mean, I'm just saying, you never, I literally watched this dude on YouTube and he doesn't even play shows. He doesn't play any shows. He just puts music on YouTube and he's just a media DJ. He's literally just a media DJ. Pretty much what I am right now and I, cause I'm not really playing shows and I'm not really doing nothing. I'm just like kind of just like on my own thing, still figuring out what I want to do with my music. And I'm like, I'm not as big. Like, obviously, I'm not okay. I got like 162 subscribers. That's it. And I got over like 13,000 views in total in all of my videos that have been rare. And I know there's one video I was like a TikTok that blew up to like 1.2k views or some shit. I was like, holy, so we actually doing something. So I was like, all right, let's keep this channel going let's keep this rolling and keep it rolling so then basically i started putting out more and more and more music and everything and that's what i'm just saying and i wrote awesome music i also been producing force uh fortnite as well that's why i'm play like i'm kind of like have fortnite playing in the background because fortnite is like one of the games that i actually played when i was little and actually i'm going to tell you this right now i had a deep obsession with the game honestly that's how it started i had a deep, deep obsession and i was spending money like donkey crazy i was oh yeah i was horrible it was it was pretty horrible and in fact it was pretty sick to the point where i was able to like i walked away from the game for like about six months and i came back to it recently and now it's like hey i can play it or like have it in the background and playing it. it's like it's so cool it's it's like man i was like man i miss the days when we used to just we used to be going party rail fucking party rail we going up there anyways point is let's get back to the music part let's go so like i said ezra music um, the only way I wanted to grow, I wanted to grow so big with the music and I wanted to basically make it all personal and everything. So just stuff like that, a little bit of everything. But yeah, I'm going to end this uh, podcast on a little note. I'm going to probably put this on YouTube or uh, iTunes or some shit just to talk about my music and everything. And a little bit of background about Ezra and me, media and shit. Just a little bit of thing. But if you like the music and everything, just simplify and play.
and enjoy your games. Peace out.